adjust the screws of the arc battery base to ensure it on the floor horizontally. Put the battery base on the floor. Stack one arc battery pack on the base. Remember to remove the partial top cover of the battery pack. Then stack the second and third arc battery pack. Install the safety pot in the final arc battery pack. Notice. The safety pot needs to be installed at the top battery. However, once the number of the battery pack is higher than 7, one more safety pot should be installed in the middle battery. Stack the final battery pack. Finally, fasten the safety pot of the battery system to the wall. And please don't remove the partial top cover of the final battery pack. Connect the metal connectors between battery packs. Make sure all the connectors on both sides of the arc battery are well connected. Remove all the dustproof cover attached to the battery pack. Connect the ground cable between battery packs. Connect the positive and negative power cable between all the battery packs. Connect the communication cable from the link out port of the top battery pack to the link in port of the next battery pack and connect all of them one by one. Power and communication cables from the hybrid inverter need to go through the rubber cover. Then connect the negative power cable to the B80- port of the bottom battery pack. Connect the positive power cable to the B80 plus port of the top battery pack and connect the communication cable to the PCS port of the top battery pack. Finally, put the rubber cover to the partial top cover. Install the dustproof covers back to the floating terminals. Please remember to connect the ground cable made by the installer from the whole arc battery system to the earth point.